Welcome to zipcalculation.com. For any inquiry, you can email us zipcalculation at gmail.com. WhatsApp slash call plus 62821144834491. Today's topic is bullet string spreadsheet calculation. Before that, you need to subscribe our YouTube channel zipcalculation.com so that you can get the updated uh, video okay so the, the structural calculation is to check the stress the bola on the pontoon deck so we are select the steel wire here to be 2 inch okay uh, 6 times 37 galvanized IWRC is the model and then the breaking strength the breaking strength for this bola uh, 140 tons Okay, normally this uh, breaking strength is uh, is a time spore from the safety working load. Okay, and then the working load uh, the working load is a half of the bit. So this is the uh, the one of the uh, uh, breaking strength, and then this one uh, compared to the Newton is the this the one. So y this one is the is the automatic formula so you don't need to change but uh, for this breaking strength strength you need to change okay depends on your ball line. so the all over stress the all over stress is depends on the uh, uh, this one this depends on the material so uh, at the moment because we are using the material high tensile steel es36 so the yield stress is a 36 kilogram per millimeter square compared to the newton we are getting three five, uh, three or three five five. So the allowable tension stress. So this the allowable tension stress from the SIP uh, uh, graphic classification rules. We are getting zero point six times the Gilly stress. So we will get the two one one Newton per millimeter. And then the allowable bending stress. We are getting zero point six times Gilly stress. We will get the two one one. Uh, Newton per millimeter square. Uh, also the same all over shear stress. We are getting 0 0.4 uh, times uh, yield stress. Yield stress. So we get the 141 uh, Newton per millimeter square. So this the all over. Make sure that uh, the result is not more than than this uh, all over tension stress. If the offer uh, if the offer the strengths uh, from this the over and then you have to change your material or you have to reduce uh, the breaking strength or the safety working load or you have to reduce that uh, you have to make it higher the thickness okay this the other one the, the thickness okay and make it higher the thickness okay uh, all right so this is the one the the bolar principle dimension that we have to change okay whatever the what you call it whatever you have the this uh, uh you have the size so you just change this here you just change okay uh, and then uh, we'll be automatically will be automatically update the uh, formula okay so the others you don't need to change so whatever in the the red color here the text you need to change but if you are engineer also you might try to add something else also lah. okay this is just like the basic guidance for you to do the bollard strength okay so now the loading condition on this uh, bollard so the loading condition is t1 okay this is the t1 right and then this one is the right side reaction because uh, this uh, wire pulling pulling uh, pulling and then tied to the this the bolat so we will get the tension and then the reaction okay, this is the tension this one is the reaction pause so tension uh, you, you get here uh, okay and then the reaction pause also we get uh, Newton uh, from the this the reaction and we will get the uh, moment so the moment maximum from the high here because the 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 high of this the uh, steel wire or rule will be uh, getting the maximum position here so this is the maximum 
so the maximum force okay so the maximum uh, we will get around this okay and right now we need to check the section property of this the bolat uh, because we are using the steel right so the steel uh, how much the thickness uh, what's the high okay what's the high and then what's the diameter so from this the section uh, from the this section okay just now this one is the thickness right this one is the uh, t1 the thickness of the bolat Okay, and then the thickness of the uh, what they call it the angle bar is uh, 50 mm so you get the 50 mm okay same thing like this also this one is the thickness of it okay now uh, you need to uh, this one is automatic also inertia uh, section modulus also getting and then the area so uh, the area or uh, the area of this the bola also will become uh, automatic okay we get the automatic result okay the total area 1636 uh, is here so as long as you change the you change the uh, dimension is here uh, the radius the high and then the length everything and then this one you will get the uh, result yeah the area so you don't need to change anything as long as this like the Five, uh, like the five, and then you uh, have the uh, what they call it yeah, inside the T power inside the plane. Okay, they call the uh, play bar. Okay, so the checking the bending stress just now, right? So you got to check checking bending stress. Checking bending stress. Okay, we get around one hundred seven. So just now the check uh, bending stress is the. Uh, 211 right so this one is a 211 so it's, a, it's, it's still acceptable because below then uh, all over bending stress if this the one is the more than than that so this will be automatic uh, uh, mention fail okay because this one is a pulse right and the same checks C stress also we are getting lower than 141 here 141 okay the newton per millimeter square the section modulus uh, so already uh, check the bending so this one check bending stress uh, okay. uh, so now this one is the appendix so this one is the appendix one the appendix okay but this one is from the um, uh, what they call it is the from the autocad okay so you just change uh, whatever the necessary is here the dimension uh, okay this one is also 140 ton is the breaking strength the breaking strength and then the U stress 36 36 so let's say uh, you want to use for uh, uh, my steel right so you just came here 24 so will be automatically uh, change this here to 35 1.1 1.1 and this one is a uh, the allowable tension stress is the 141 and this one is allowable bending stress is 141 allowable stress 94 so whatever you have changed this year I mean, let's say you are going to use, uh, use the my state so you just gain 24 and it become 235 but uh, this one is going to be because uh, you gonna bending stress is uh, 141 also still acceptable you gonna say still acceptable One hundred forty one. So, even the one hundred forty one, also, if you're using still acceptable, but let's say I need to change this here, uh, might be around two hundred fifty ton. One hundred time become fail here, yeah. and the other because it's a more than than this. Okay. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe our channel uh, YouTube, Safe Calculation Com. If you need Safe Calculation and Safe Design Drawing, you may contact us. Email Safe Calculation at Gmail dot com. 
WhatsApp slash call plus 62821448 Office call plus 62778480 So www.sipcalculation.com Thank you very much for watching. Bye bye.